Um, so we're gonna shift things up a little bit uh, with our 3D printed Aventador. Um, we're gonna start shying away from some of the uh, 3D printing uh, of the parts and we're gonna start talking about mechanical parts such as brakes, okay? So this is uh, a very important part of the car, obviously. Uh, if, you've got a lot of, if you've got a lot of go, you need a lot of woe. And so that's where we're gonna start doing uh, the next series on, which is getting the brakes together. So we have to plumb the brake system. We have to run the parking brake uh, wires, lines, and um, I'll go th and actually make some brackets. And so I'll go through all of that with you on how uh, I'm making the brackets. Um, most of the things we have to do is fab it up. So we're gonna start here at the back end. Um, what we have is we have a 14 inch rotor and we have a six piston caliper that, we're mount that we've mounted on this. We've used uh, standard mounting hardware that we actually got from Willwood. So this is actually all in place and ready to go. And the pads are even in it. What we have to do next is we actually have to put in our parking brake. So this is uh, just a single piston caliper um, that is operated by a mechanical um, actuator. And this will actually be what we use to put on the parking brake. There will be one of these on each side. Now, what I've done is we have uh, two extra holes in the spindle that's behind uh, the uh, rotor here. And I've rough cut out a piece of material after making a paper template that has the hole locations of the parking brake So if we look back here at the spindle, you can see the two holes we're going after. And those are where we're gonna mount our parking brake. Right there, okay. So what we're doing is, is that I've drilled the two holes for uh, on the spindle and I'm just uh, grinding it down to so it So it's kind of a repetitive process, so I didn't film it, uh, most of it anyway. But you gotta put the bracket on, take it off, put it on, take it off. Make sure everything fits right. We're gonna tighten this back on, and then we're gonna try our, our caliper. So now we're gonna fit our caliper.
Okay, so we've done all the work for the bracket and we've got our parking brake in. Now, it still needs uh, some work. We'll take the bracket out, we'll mic it, we'll put it into SolidWorks and then probably have it laser or water jet cut um, out of steel. Uh, that will just make it much, much safer. The next, uh, next video, we're going to start um, working on the uh, Willwood calipers. So we've got to set these, we've got to shim them, and set all the clearances. So that will be uh, next time. Uh, so thanks again for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed uh, this video, and uh, we'll keep them coming.